Hello, I'm Dr. Roger Goldstein. I'm a respirologist at West Park Healthcare Centre at the University of Toronto. For many of us, taking care of our health is important. We go to the dentist to get our teeth checked, and we visit our doctor to have our blood pressure and cholesterol levels tested. But have you ever thought of having your lungs tested? Spirometry is a simple breathing test that can help in the diagnosis of lung disease. Not everyone needs to have a spirometry test. So ask your doctor for a spirometry test if you are over 40 and smoke, or if you used to smoke, if you cough a lot, if you become short of breath when walking quickly, if you are worried about the health of your lungs, or if you are already receiving treatment for lung disease. Spirometry measures how much air you can blow out of your lungs and how fast you can blow it out. A spirometry test can be used to diagnose lung diseases, such as asthma and chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, also known as COPD. It can be used to check the current condition of your lungs, to help find the cause of shortness of breath, or to check the effectiveness of your medication. It's a completely painless test that can often be done in a doctor's office or clinic and usually takes less than 10 minutes. Let me show you how easy it is. We're just gonna do some breathing tests today. I'm gonna ask you to repeat it three times. You'll be asked to sit down and then breathe through a mouthpiece while wearing a nose clip. What I want you to do is start off with normal breathing, take a big breath in. You'll need to take in as big a breath as possible and then blow the air out as fast as you can. And push! Keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. You keep, keep, keep blowing keep pushing, keep pushing, until keep your pushing, lungs feel pushing, completely empty, out, at which time the technician will tell you to breathe squeeze normal. Squeeze it out, squeeze it out, and big breath up, all the way up now. Good job. It's that simple. The test is usually repeated three times to make sure that the readings are quite accurate. You may be given a puffer with some medication to breathe in. And then the test will be repeated to see if your lungs have responded to the medication. The test results will tell your doctor or healthcare provider how well your lungs are working. The earlier spirometry is done, the earlier lung disease can be detected and treated. That's important because treatment can reduce symptoms and flare-ups, slow the progression of disease and help improve the quality of your life. So look after your lungs, talk to your doctor about spirometry. For more information, visit www.lung.ca. Thank you.